Hi guys, um, what we're going to do is we're just going to go through a bit about the C programming format and layout. Um, now, we've got include along with some random gibberish numbers. Now, STD does not stand for sexually transmitted disease, which some of you probably have picked up on, some of you probably haven't, some of you, I'm hoping no one here doesn't know what STD used to stand for, um, but it stands for standard. Now we've got um, standard. Now what does I/O mean in this case? It means input output, because we've got to be able to provide some input to the program, and it's got to be able to provide output back to us. And we've also got the standard library. Now we've got the main. Uh, main class um, and it's in that it's got print function I believe or print format I'm um, sorry just thinking about my maths assignment <laughs> we've got hello world in quotation marks now anything within double quotation marks means that it's a string and it'll be printed out as is unless it's got these little fun little pieces here now there's, there's other types of fun little pieces and all, um, and just remember that at the end of each line we require a semicolon, I believe it's pronounced, um, I'm not too sure really, um, and in the return file we've got return zero, so if everything's correct it will just return zero. So now we're going to run this and as you can see we've got hello world. I wish I could move the positioning of this, but I haven't bothered figuring that out. Um, and now what if we were to change it to an A? Now, I'm hoping that it's going to be loud enough. Um, my volume's up pretty high. A stands for alert here. Yeah. The backslash A is alert. Now, not really useful at this point, but We'll, it'll be more useful later on. Now, we'll go through the debugger later when we kind of need to, but for now we're just going to end the tutorial like this and we'll come back next time and we'll do a bit more with actually displaying output other than just the hello world. So I'll see you next time and remember to like and subscribe.